Tea for teen. Get the kids out of the room. Whoa, no, no, no way, Orochi. Dude, okay, so... Like, these... Out okay, it's cool that they made these outfits. I'm definitely using the default outfit. These pants... These pants are way, like... They got the, like, the... This is, like, the Kurt... Does everybody remember, like, uh, Big Trouble in Little China? And Kurt Russell had his oh, jeans tucked and into no his boots. Got them tucked right in, baby. And then he's got... He's got his tank top tucked into his jeans, too. He's got he's got the double tuck going on. Godlike. There we go. Hell yeah. That's the look. That's the look they're going for. Anyway, all right, back to all right. All right. You're a beast. No, but seriously, the the the, the like the jeans. They got like jeans. They're like I don't know. I don't know. He's not crippled. He just I don't. It was something from the movie. I don't know. <clears throat> it's been so long since I've seen. I don't. <laughs> I don't remember exactly why he was in a wheelchair. All right, so this is this is standard. This is this, this is just close. To, this is close C forward A into his normal. This is this should this is this is a, this used to be a one frame command grab. I don't know if it's still one frame. Maybe we can do frame by frame. It probably is still just one frame. I mean, he's a grappler. It's good that YouTube has frame by frame. So there's frame one. Oh, maybe it's two frames. Look, look, animation, and then Yamazaki gets grabbed. You see that? Maybe it's two frames. Probably not. It's probably still one frame. It's just probably the way it's animated. Boom, boom. And they didn't show any EX moves either. So here's the first... Okay, so here's the first target combo. So he does... He does 2A, right? He does 2A, and he does far A. And then he just changing the... He just changing the far C. He's changing the far C. Like, all right. And to his... This is half circle forward kick. This is probably half circle forward light kick. This is run grab. Because it's comboed off heavies before in the old games. This is how he this is how he confirmed if he was like far away from you. And I guess it's also and I wonder if this scales because that I wonder if this is OTG. Because that's what that's why I guess that's why Clark's um that's the technical reason for like Clark's um flash elbow into super scale is because flash elbow is an OTG. So I wonder if that just that looks like OTG state. So I wonder if this is gonna scale. And then this, this is even weirder. This is like super fucking weird. So he does he does close C. He does close C into forward B. And it looks like he chain he chains this into C plus D. I don't know if this is a different, maybe like an additional command normal after four or B or something, but he does his C, what looks like the same animation as C plus D. Yori gets knocked into the air. He's in the air, right? So it looks like, it looks like it's going to be the knockback from C plus D, or at least knocks down. And then before he, before he, like, look, he just, it look, okay, it looks like he gets knocked up actually. So I think it's a different move. It doesn't look like the wall splat. It looks like he's being knocked up. And then before he gets, knocked away then he then he grabs him and does which command grab it was just like regular yeah there's just like his regular like one frame command grab again into into otg otg climax and this shit is fucking fun like every time i fucking see so first he fucking does this shit where he like he does like the hulk smash fucking brom league of legends whatever fucking digging up the ground and it's like there's this there's this delay because it's like in a it's like in a it's a it's a shock wave so it comes out there or he's just like standing here he's just like standing there and the fucking ground comes up like ghosts and goblins like super ghosts and goblins and the ground's like starting to shift and it's like one two and then he just fucking he just fucking disappears he just fucking goes. And then, and then he's like floating in the air. And then he, and then he just sort of scoops his ass up. I don't know why that shit's so funny to me, dude. Holy fuck. It's like, whoop. <laughs> it's because of the it's, the, it's the delay. Like he does, he's like, boom, and then boy, him. <laughs> <laughs> this is fucking powerball. I don't know. That shit's that that shit's tight though. 
<laughs> just alley oops to himself. All right, so they the thing that's weird about Oroji Sherby is they don't show her kisses like her her course forward A. So you can do you can do course forward A B C or D, and it'll put a little like a it's like a satellite orb on the screen. If you ever play that chick from Belty Blood, it's kind of like that except they go off instantly and they have like hella active frames. They just like appear on the screen like orbs, which is like her main zoning that's super annoying. But they don't they don't they don't show it at all in this, which is really which is really strange. Cause that's like, but I mean, they don't show all of Orochi Shio's moves either. He had his like jump grab, like jumps over, like grabs you and you combo off of it, kind of like Chris's. So first she has this. This is a new move. This looks like just a new like safe special, which might replace. Ghost Pile was saying it might replace her. She had a she had a course go back kick that's kind of like regular Shermie's course go back kick where she where she jumps. But in 2K2UM, she like jumps and spins, and the spin can hit you with lightning. But it sucked. It was like, it was. had weird frames, weird hitboxes, and like, hardly anybody used it. So she has that. And this is this is one of her main, like. This air course four kick. Right here. She goes in this arc. And you see, she also has like, this command normal that puts her in the air. This is from 2K2UM. So this puts her in the air, and then you can cancel in the air specials, which which means this move, and then the super, the super she does. Those are two air moves. She but had both of those in 2K2UM. And this that flip move that she does, that special, you can do that from back dashes in the old game, and she either she either does this small flip or she does like a big arc, and she can mix up how she does it, and it makes it really it makes it really annoying to approach her. Yeah, I don't think it was in... It might have been... I don't think it was in 98 UM. I feel like it was only in 2K2, but I, I may be mistaken. But she had, like, a really full moveset in 2K2. And then this looks like... Was this target combo? No, it's just... 2, 2B, close A, 5B. So her 5B is canceled, just like regular Serbian is now. And this move, this is a little, like, short range, that 2-hit. That right there. That's a 2-hit projectile. It used to be in old games. It was safe mid-screen, so maybe, maybe it's still unsafe, and that's why she has that little lightning kick move. But you could do, you could do like two B into that move, like randomly mid-screen. It would, it would combo, it would combo like even from long range. You could, and you could obviously super cancel it here. And then this Raikouken super, this move is hella, 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 hella fast in old games. It's like two frames. It's like super duper fast. I don't know if they're gonna keep that property. Maybe only on level two, or maybe, who knows. But like, even the level one was super fast. It didn't have involve, but it punished a bunch of stuff, and it was hard to like. You could like, you could almost reaction like reaction anti or hops with it, as long as they didn't, they couldn't get like a move out in time, because the move was so so quick. So it's po it's possible, it's possible, it's really fast. I don't know if it's possible to really see the frames. So it'd be like one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Uh, I don't know. Actually, I can't tell which is the flash. Okay, one sec. I gotta watch Chizuru. So one, two, three, four. It looks like three. Then fourth frame, it's the flash. So maybe three frames. And then four, four, five, six. So maybe level one, six frames. Maybe like three before the flash, three after. From my 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 YouTube analysis, this super is funky. Lightning lightning back kicks you in the face. And Chris Chris got the old pose back, which is cool. The double the double flame hands. Yeah, so this move used to be this movie. So he you know he does two. 2B close A, forward A, into the into this move. So this this move he's comboing to used to be a proximity unblockable. So it used to be it's a special you can only do close up and when your when your opponent is throwable, they don't have throwing ball. But it still had startup and it would hit it would physically hit them, but you couldn't block it. I don't I really doubt they're gonna give this move that property. It seems like it might just be a move. That you just combo that you can just block and you can combo into. Who knows though? But I mean, if they actually brought back the actual property of the proximity of block, well, it's gonna be really strange. Cause the way they work is always really wonky. Cause you can like you can like trade with them and stuff. It's really it's really weird. 
Because it's a command grab, but it's an attack, but you can't block it. It's just weird. So this is like a classic combo. You would just you would cancel the last hit of this into it. You can cancel into any special move, and usually would just you would just get light DP off of it. And if you are in max mode in 98, you could let it recover. You could let this recover, and you could do jump D after it because they had weird. You got weird pushback properties in max mode in old games. This is a cla this is a classic combo. You usually saw this in 2K2. This is like an easy combo in 2K2. You would just combo like close C forward A into heavy DP, which is four hits, and you just cancel the the third hit in the super. But it cost you two bars in that game because you had to super cancel. So like, this is kind of like the noob combo because you wanted to combo just straight in the super. It did a little more damage, but it wasn't as his like optimal. It's comboing like right in the raw super, but now it's just free. And this super's new. Usually you would do a Rochinagi in the old games, which he still has in this. I don't know if this is, maybe it has like anti-air properties because it kind of looks like it does the same thing as a Rochinagi, it's just like a single hit, but it looks like it goes up. It looks like it has vertical range. So maybe it'll be, maybe it's like an anti-air or something. And then Kyo talks some shit or whatever. And it's like, okay, and he has a feather and it's cool. He got some feather physics, physics going on. All right, that's cool. And then this is the, e then he, he doesn't show you how he combos into this. He does the EX version of this com command grab or whatever the hell it is. Hit grab. And actually this animation, this last kick, this is, this used to be, this used to be the animation for his dodge attack. In 98, if you picked extra mode, if you did the dodge and then the canned attack after it, you did kick, that was the move you got. And it was, it was special cancelable. So they're using it for that. They gave it back to him in, in 2K2UM, he had this move too. You hit like, he had a special, normal Chris had a special dodge command. You hit like, I think it was light kick and then a direction or something. I forget what, forget what it was, but he would like turn it and you could do, you could do the dodge into this, into this move and like special cancel it. So they found, a, found another way to give him that animation, I guess. And it looks like just like regular Chris, he can do four day and juggle. So there's a Rochinagi. Just like, just like old boy kill. And he has a level one version too. And there's his quarter, this is quarter go back punch. So there's EX version. Looks like it combos off heavies. I'm wondering if this this com can actually combo off lights though. I wonder how how like fast this is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eight. No, it definitely. You have to. The move has to be like eight frames or something to combo off to combo off lights. It's. it's I don't. I think it's only going to combo off heavies. But that looks like combo fodder. Just. Ground bounce, three hits of DP. That's probably BNB you'll see pretty often. And apparently everybody was disappointed that he doesn't he doesn't turn into Orochi in his super best. I guess everybody was expecting that. By the way, so people were saying this is a reference. This looks like a uh, red armor or like firebrand from Ghouls and Ghosts. Doesn't he do this? He like flies above the he's like flying above the flames and he's like flapping his wings or whatever, right? Yeah, that's a, that's all that reminds me of. I don't know if the, I was trying to look for a screenshot. I couldn't find one. I don't know if the, that's how, if that's actually what that's from. But it's funky looking. But yeah, I feel like I'm still gonna use the normal costumes. I can't I can't handle I can't handle the the jeans and the boots. I don't. I like the top. I like the tops. I like like the robes, but the je the jeans tucked into the boots. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I can handle that. I don't. I don't know if I can handle all that Kurt Russell. Yeah, I'm also wondering if they, if, since they're already releasing the trailer and people can play him at Evo, I'm wondering if they're gonna like, uh, they're gonna do one of those. You can play him right now or whatever, because they're already gonna be, they're already gonna be on the floor. But yeah, I'm hoping for. I'm hoping for. I'm hoping for some more juice. They might do like a like a like a the next team teaser or some shit like that. Yeah, DLC base mail is still coming.